Hi, I'm Tina Richards, skin and health expert. I'm going to talk to you about how to prevent clogged pores. You need to incorporate a thorough skincare regime and the secret is to be regular with it. You first of all need to make sure that you cleanse your skin thoroughly. And what I recommend you do is cleanse it once in the morning and then at night do a double cleanse. This means using a lotion or a cream or a wash first to remove makeup. I like to use a lightweight facial lotion for this and we've got some products here. This is a really good one. This, the Simple Purifying Cleanser, great for removing makeup. You will need to use a separate eye makeup remover to remove your eye makeup as well. Then once you've done that, then you want to cleanse your skin again. You can either use a lotion or a cream if your skin is quite dry, but if it's normal, combination or oily, then you can use a wash such as some of these. And I've also got one here that's very good for skin that's prone to blemishes. Regular exfoliation is also really key because you want to lift away those dead skin cells that can block pores. They can mix with sebum and oil on the skin, get into the pores, and then once that blockage actually oxidizes with the air, like an apple turning brown when you cut it, it causes a blackhead. And if bacteria gets into the pore under the blockage, then you can get a spot. So exfoliation is very important. You can use uh, facial scrubs like this one. There are also masks and cleansers like these here, which use alpha hydroxy acids. Alpha hydroxy acids are fruit acids that lift away the dead skin cells and they include glycolic acid, lactic acid and salicylic acid. I would use a scrub or an AHA product once or twice a week if you've got a sensitive skin and perhaps to begin with and then you can progress if your skin is more resistant and doesn't react to skincare you can step it up perhaps you know four times a week if you're really trying to get rid of um, blackheads on your skin. The facial scrubs that I like contain very soft round beads and I like ones that contain jojoba beads because it's natural. But you can also get scrubs that contain oatmeal as well and that's good particularly for sensitive skin. So that's very good. You can also, once a week, do a purifying mask and these typically contain clay and an ingredient that you want to look out for is kaolin clay and that helps to absorb excess oil and impurities from within the pore, drawing it out onto the surface of the skin. So I would just do that once a week and avoid the eye area. You can also use these nose and chin strips that you apply to a wet face and then you wet the strip a little bit more as well and let them dry and then you just peel off a bit like a plaster and that can help to unclog pores as well but you do need to use those quite regularly so once a week. Beauty tools, either a rotating sonic cleansing brush or a vibrating ultrasonic um, spatula such as this one are really helpful for using again once to three times a week to unclog pores to get in and really deep cleanse the skin. And I like to use retinol treatment myself. I find this keeps pores really squeaky clean. I've got one here called Help Me by Philosophy. And retinol is very good because it's keratolytic. And what that means is it breaks down dead skin cells so it gets, can get in the pore and help to break down the debris at the surface of the pore to clean it out, gently exfoliating the skin. And I would start using a retinol product. It may also say retinol palmitate on the packaging, make sure that's high up on the list of ingredients so you've got enough retinol in it. I would start using that once to twice a week and then you can start using it on all time at nights and step it up to even every night. You can also mix it with a little moisturiser to make it more mild if you want to. So collectively, for your skincare regime to prevent block pores, you really want to be double cleansing at night, cleansing once in the morning, exfoliating 
and also using a purifying mask once a week. You can use your pore strips as well if you want to and beauty tools are really helpful as well to help unclog and loosen that debris of your skin. And that's the way to prevent clogged pores.